I remember the morning it happened. Two giant hairy balls hung from a strange moving membrane upon high. The strange, bewildering sack contained muffled screams that sounded to be human, it hung straight, directly down from the sky. Across the street, some nuns were leaving their convent for a morning outdoor prayer. The sisters looked up way way. Up directly above them they were thrillingly caught unaware. Immediately, they all screamed and took flight with the fright as they scurried themselves back inside. Continually during that morning, people called in sick to work. Many, many of the townsfolk prepared for disaster as they decided to stay home and hide. Businesses were closed, schools, and the post office, even the highways, they were all closed too. The giant sack kept growing larger and hairier. Neither the police, NASA, or the government could explain what it was, or what we should do. It just kept growing, and deepening into a color more and more profoundly in a colorful blue. Multiple missing persons were frantically reported throughout the day. Most were reported to have just simply vanished into thin air in front of their children, pets, and spouses unexpectedly mid-conversation. People were going out of their minds in the worst and most sorrowful way. Soon sirens were heard as I peered out of my window. The sight was most disturbing to see I must say. As a massive crew of a rescue team appeared on the scene, guns and ammo were out on display. I recognized Constable Mumford as Get cocked his rifle with care. He aimed his weapon, along with all of the other men at once in attempt to burst the large hairy ball sack. But on the count of three, more than a hundred men disappeared completely, as if I had suffered hallucination. A grim feeling rang through the empty streets and the air. It was midday when the sky began to darken, heavy rain clouds began to descend. The heavy rain seemed to melt and shrink down the ball sack until it had completely disappeared. Exactly what happened could and would never be explained and the missing people were never seen again.